Santa knows where to find all the best and hottest smartphones just in time to make this Christmas better and bigger than ever. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless. Ho, 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 ho. While many are still out and about grabbing last-minute items for the upcoming Christmas holiday, local churches are urging those who can to remember the ones who are less fortunate. In almost every community, a blessing box can be found full of mostly canned goods and other various items. But with the holidays here, more items are coming out of the boxes than what is being donated. If it's low, we all chip in and keep it as full as we can. So I don't think that it's less filled. I think more things get picked out more than dropped off, but we pick up the slack with it. Most blessing boxes are set up so that anyone can donate and in return, anyone can take items out. Any donation is welcomed. Anything from clothes to socks, gloves, canned food items. We ask no cash be put in it just for safety reasons, no alcohol and no tobacco products. Jeannie Johnson with the Militant Pillar and Ground of Truth Church of God in Pikeville says her church will make special arrangements if you are donating larger items or if you are in need of a specific item. We have a lot of unfortunate people and families in our community, especially children. We just wanted to make sure if somebody was hungry, there was something they could come and cook, or there's some prepared food that's already in there. To donate or ask for something specific, contact Pastor Sandy Lane at the number listed on your screen. In Pikeville, Shelby Porter, EKB News.